My friend Barbara Ann Davison is a singer and an actress and an older adult. Plus, she is part of the Actors Fun Center Stage group. She invited us to watch and to enjoy a night of jazz with older adults. We're at the Dish, 201 8th Avenue. But who was there? Well, besides Barbara and we had Nikki Capra, Isabel Demenji, Wendy Luck, Susan Mack, Jean Ramirez, and Dana Reedy. At the piano, Takaki Otomo. And also, Cameron Brown. Let's enjoy. Why the jazz vocals? Um, well, m most of the the creator, Jay Clayton, is a very dear friend of mine for many years. They've been our regular, my my friends for many years. They've been coming here all this time, and so I, it's an obligation. I mean, they asked me, and I said yes. Is this but weekly, once in a month? They, whenever they, they, they have something new, whenever they are ready to do something, you know, we are open for them. You know, it's open dates. We don't know exactly the day. I mean, it's up to them. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Barbara Ann. Yes. That's Jessie over there. She's a she's a jazz singer. You are. Professional jazz singer. Good for in you. Florida. Yes, and she I came am. to say I'm hello. A and cabaret should... singer. And this is my first jazz gig. So working, oh with, Jay, working with Jay Clayton and Sheila Jordan oh is going to be here, but she's out of town. Oh, yeah. Oh, well, we'd to meet you too. Uh -huh. there. Make yourself comfortable, uh, Barbara, and you're going to sing. Yeah. You're excited. excited thrilled. Scared. Um, I've, done, I've done theater. I've done theater and I've done cabaret. But this is my debut as a jazz artist. Hopefully I'll be even scatting tonight. So I'm excited. It's a great group. And Jay Clayton is our... It's a wonderful thing. She is, a, she is a, one of the best... I'm Jay Clayton. I know you are. You're and a I, producer? I'm a Jay Clayton. No, I, I'm a teacher. I'm a singer and teacher, but I, I believe that you learn to sing by singing. And by that I mean performing. Excellent. And so I all my all my teaching, whatever, thirty some years, I, I always this is a this is a combination of several workshops that I call nuts and bolts. Oh, it's like the basics of cueing and counting off tempos. All levels. There'll be all levels of singers. Could they look you up on online website? You have a website. You can give an address. You know, I do have a. I'm j at jclayton.com. If anybody's interested, they could email me, and then I put them on a singer list because I also give scat labs, which are improv workshops. But this workshop was singing the stand. And I find various places. I've done Don't Tell Mama, I've done, you know, Bar Thalia, but I like it here because it's very casual. Tell me about the musicians. And some of these singers work with me for years. Some sometimes it's their first time singing. Sometimes they're they're professionals as well. Anyway, for me it's it's inspiring. And we all learn something. That's right. What we are the names all... of the musicians? Give me the names of the people. And so we have Tak Tak Taka. Takaaki Otomo on piano, and Cameron Brown, who I've known for about 40 years on bass. And they're fantastic. You'll get it. Thank you. Thank you so much. Welcome, everyone. But this is where we take most of our meals, the dish. And I got the bright idea a few whatever ago that why not put some music up here? So here we go. This is usually a combination of workshops that I do. I call it nuts and bolts, and I'm still working on nuts and bolts. Um, excuse me if I get nostalgic every once in a while. That's what you do in your late 70s, or no. a septarian. Right? You can say whatever you want. One, two, three. shall above all things be glad and young. Because if you're glad, 
whatever life you wear, it will become you. And if you're young, whatever's living will yourself become. Songs were made to sing. Every day is spring while you go. None can refuse. Time flies so fast. Too dear to lose. Though it may be just for today, share our love. We must come home. So blue the sky. to have enough beat tempo to really sad songs. It's about letting go, letting go of, um, really hot. Am I loud? No, it's fine. <laughs> okay. um, it's about letting the heart speak when it's sad. So that's what the letting go is about. Quando se queixa da uma gente Deixa, 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 deixa Ninguém vive mais do que uma vez Deixa Diz que sim pra não dizer talvez Deixa A paixão também existe Deixa
Deixa o coração falar também Porque ele tem Raça demais quando se queixa Então a gente deixa, 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 deixa Ninguém vive mais do que uma vez Deixa Diz que sempre a não dizer talvez Deixa a paixão também existe Deixa Não me deixes ficar triste is an actress known for All Good Things, a film from 2010, We Own the Night from 2007, and Going in Style 2017. And recently in the TV show Orange is the New Black, here is 
our chat with Barbara Ann. Barbara Ann? Yeah. You've done cabaret? Yeah. You've done theater? Uh-huh. You do TV? Yeah. And what now, else? And now, and now, at age 83, I'm embarking on a whole new career, which is jazz singing. It's been in me since I was eight years old that I listened to jazz. I loved it, I loved it, I loved it. And I was listening to Lambert Hendricks and Ross and all the great musicians, Charlie Parker, everything. And what happened was I always loved it, but I never thought, oh boy, I'd love to sing that kind of music. It happened that a month ago I met in the doctor's office. So what happened at the doctor's well, office? Well, this is serendipity in action. I was in the doctor's office talking to this woman, and uh, I was saying about how it's wonderful when you're an entertainer or a performer, there's no such thing as retirement. You just keep doing it like the Energizer Bunny until you don't do it anymore. And she said, oh, I know what you mean. I'm a singer. And I said, I know you are. I said, well, those How did you know? How did you I know? Because she's Sheila Jordan. It's named Jordan who wrote Jordan. But anyway, she was brought up by Charlie Parker and his wife, Chan Parker, in Detroit. She just celebrated her 91st birthday. I celebrated it with her at Birdland last night. Anyway, she, so we started talking. I said, you know, I've always wanted to be a jazz singer. It's been in me since I was a kid. And she said, you've got to take lessons. So I. How long ago was this? <laughs> Maybe about two months ago. Two months ago. So I began taking lessons with her friend, Jay, Jay Clayton. The two of them teach together very often. She called Nuts and Bolts, which had people who had been doing jazz singing for a long while, and me. And I like, joked, I said, I'm your virgin scatist today. She was doing scat singing, going around, you know, the, the thing. And I thought, oh, can I do this? And it came out of my mouth. All of those arrangements, those chords that I've never explored outside of myself. Maybe I sang a little bit in the bathroom or in the kitchen, but I never done it in public. And it was, as, it was as if that voice was there all those decades ago. And I realized, I just did a performance at uh, The Dish on Monday night, and I did two numbers. And I thought, and I got, I'm getting praise. And I thought, this is the voice that I've always, always wanted to have. This is the voice that I was meant to have. All that theater and the cabaret and everything were wonderful, but there's something absolutely new that I've come upon through serendipity, God, whatever, in meeting Sheila Jordan uh, that, and, and Jay Clayton, that I feel it's a whole, at 83, you can really reinvent yourself. And that's what I'm doing. I absolutely adore it. And after you perform, what happened? Oh, I felt, I felt so free. I felt wonderful. Uh, a lot of friends had come to see me. And Carlton Brown, who was the bass player, uh, and by the way, the piano player is Ta Taka Oto Ono, but Carlton Brown, who's played with all the great ones, including Sheila and Jay, he pat me on the back and he said, you've got it, kid. You've got it, kid. <laughs> I mean, I thought, and I spoke to somebody last night at Birdland, and she said, he doesn't just mince words. He would not, if he didn't feel that, he wouldn't have said that. And I do, it's like, where, this was all in my head, all these arrangements and everything that would allow me to be able to scat and sing some of my favorite songs in a completely new way. And um, I love it. I absolutely love it. We're doing our next performance on in uh, December. Uh, I think it's the, the second Monday, whether that's the 16th or whatever, at the Dish Restaurant on 8th Avenue and 20th Street. Uh, and it will be, I just, I hardly know what to say, but I was so thrilled and so many friends came and they said, you are completely different, Barbara. You were Ann. great. You were You're, great. Thank you. I saw you. Congratulations. Oh, thank you. I just, I loved it. I can't God wait bless. to do it again. Cannot wait to do it again. And thank you for coming and for for capturing this because I never want to forget and this. Three and four and. With Jim and Paul, and I kissed some other chaps. Once I was young, never was naive. I thought I had a trick or two up my imaginary sleeve. But now I know I. Oh, wow. 
What a lovely time it was, how sublime it was true. I didn't know what day it was, you held my hand. Warm like the month of May it was, and I'll say it was grand, grand. To be alive, to be young, to be mad, to be yours alone. Your face, hear your touch, hear your voice say, I'm all your own. And I didn't know what year it was. Life was no prize. I wanted love. Well, here it was, shining out of your eyes. I'm wise. And I know what time it is now. Taka. hear your voice say I'm all your own and I didn't know what year it was life was no prize I wanted love and here it was shining out of your eyes 